Alex, why don't you lead the way on Brandon Cooks? Ooh, my guy. I had him high last year. I'm high on him again this year. Uh, he's going at the end of round eight. Currently wide receiver 41. It's going pick 94. 94? Like, like I, I don't know what this guy did or whose mom. Like, I don't know if he like went on like a, a nationwide like MILF hunt or what was going on. You know what to, he like, did? What did he do? He's not, he doesn't have the big flashy social media presence that all these other number one receiver divas have. And he doesn't attract all the offensive off season attention. He doesn't do it. And he doesn't do it during the season either. He's just kind of goes about his business being a wide receiver one. Multiple teams have traded, have traded first round picks for the guy. He's kind of been, he's kind of a journeyman wide receiver and he's only 28 sort of thing. He wow. uh, had, has a thousand yards in five of the last six years. You know, ho-hum, uh, wide receiver 41, thousand yards, five of six years. I, I, the math doesn't make sense. He could be playing with Deshaun Watson. We still don't know what the status of him is. And you know what Deshaun Watson has done with his wide receiver ones going back to Hopkins and even Will Fuller last year before he got suspended. Their backup is Tyrod Taylor. We talked about Tyrod Taylor last year and him not really supporting uh, wide receiver ones. But who else do they have? Like, I, I'm Jason, we did this with Detroit. Could you name another like two pass catchers for the for the Houston Texans? It's just br- like there's nobody else there. Uh, there's literally nobody. Texans death chart receivers. Well, the only one I know is Anthony Miller because I'm a Bears fan. Yeah, and he already separated his shoulder again. There you go. Uh, other than that, they do have the QT on the team. Kiki? Yes. But that's that's those are the only two I know. Who am I missing? Nobody. There's nobody else there. There's not Let's even see. a tight like a there's not even like a legit tight end there. They've Jordan Chris Akins Conley. Is there. Yeah, no thanks. Andre Roberts. Like there's just there's nobody else there. Even if Deshaun Watson's not playing, the game script is going to favor Brandon Cooks to put up points. Because they're going to be throwing when they're down. There's no way that he does not have a thousand yard season this year, regardless of who his quarterback is. The only thing that I would say is that he's one hit away from not being in the NFL anymore because he does have those concussion issues. So hopefully that doesn't happen and he can stay healthy. He stayed healthy last year. So I, I just don't I don't understand why he's going as late as he is. I think he's insane value going as late as he is um, and somebody that I will be targeting in pretty much every draft. So end of the eighth round wide receiver 41 Brandon Cooks. I don't understand the disrespect. Last year he finished as wide receiver 15 in half PPR. Um, and now everybody thinks that he's a uh, wide receiver 40. Against Cincinnati and Tennessee the last two weeks of last year while Fuller was Fuller. Yep. I was going to say, well, Will Fuller was suspended and he was serving as the team's wide receiver one. He finished with 26 targets, 18 catches, more than 300 receiving yards and three scores. Okay. That'll play. Like the guy could absolutely blast off and be that's, I mean, that's a wide receiver. Those are back to back wide receiver one weeks. Um, and he's going to have that if the Sean plays, but no doubt that is, that's the question though. Will Deshaun Watson be the quarterback of the Houston Texans this season? I can't believe they haven't said we're, we're, we're filming this on August 23rd and there is no news. He's listed as fourth on their depth chart. Like how how is they do how are they doing this? No idea. Per ESPN, Watson could spend the 2021 season on the Texans' 53 man roster as a healthy scratch each week. The NFL has not put any restrictions on Watson during training camp as the investigation proceeds. 
Um, like that's cr- just suspend it indefinitely. Well, it's, or it's, so, like it's not even that they the NFL literally released a video yesterday that named Deshaun Watson the 18th best player in the league <laughs> as part of their top 100 series. Oh no! Like. You're going to name a guy a top 20 position at, at any position, top 20 overall in the league at 18 and give a tribute to him, but he's not playing or maybe he's playing, but we don't know. Yeah. That's, that's a tough spot to be. Um, other other uh, noteworthy thing to mention, Deshaun Watson is currently going in round 13 of drafts. He's being drafted as quarterback 20 uh, on the off chance that he plays. Jason, would you take Deshaun Watson in round 13? Yes. Uh, I mean... How, how, how long would you sit on him? Name, name a 13th round draft pick with more upside than Deshaun Watson. Um, they don't exist. There are none. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. You, there you are could zero. argue you could argue Trey Lance. Maybe. Okay. Yeah. Trey Lance, he, Justin Fields. I mean, yeah. those are the only two that I would even consider. But it's Correct. do you want to deal with Deshaun Watson potentially even going so far as being like a healthy scratch? Yeah. He's just sitting on your bench, clogging up a spot. I do, you know, I wonder if they would say, like, just put him on the IR and you could stash him somehow. Um, if they let you put him on the IR. ESPN yeah, was terrible about that Terrible about that with COVID. Do you think you're going to be good about that with a sex, a, a, I don't know, well, not a sex offender, but like a sexual assaulter? Yeah. Is that a sex offender? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, it sh- sh- should be noted, t- tune in for our uh, episode or our podcast later this week where uh, we'll be talking about some uh, draft tips and maybe some league setup stuff, uh, which that conversation would fall into. Um, My question for you before we move on is this. Y- yeah. He was wide receiver 15 with Deshaun yeah. Watson. Yep. If Deshaun Watson sits and it's Tyrod. Where does he finish with Tyrod? Um, I still think he's probably a low end wide receiver two, high end wide receiver three. I think he's a middle of the road flex to a low end flex. That's I fun. think Tyrod Taylor sucks. He's at least been around the NFL long enough where he's competent, and he he you would think that he would force feed the only weapon he has, but maybe not. Yeah. I think he's going to force feed turnovers 